Checking out the track for the demo run, yet? Just seeing where, um, where I need to go. It looks really sandy. Very sandy. What are you looking for? Just which way, which way the circuit goes. <laughs> Would be nice to know. I was also going to the DJ. Okay. Amazing day in partnership with Aramco. We've hosted um, 20 local students with an interest in STEM and motorsport more generally. I really gone on a journey with them to inspire and educate them on pathways into the sport and um, all with the aim of essentially leaving them with the inspiration they, they need to pursue a career in, uh, in motorsport. Uh, events like this are uh, extremely important to inspire the next generation. We have an incredible uh, crowd here and uh, we will uh, you know, show for one of the first times ever uh, the Formula One on the streets in Saudi with a female driver and demonstrate that uh, motorsport um, there is a space for, for everyone and we have equal opportunities, we have to follow our dreams, we have to follow our passion and uh, life is, uh, is open for everyone. When these ideas get thought of about things that we can do to, to help raise the profile of women in motorsport, we obviously do that because we want to inspire the younger generation. But I don't really think we really appreciate the impact it has until we see it. Seeing some of the young girls so emotional really hits home as to the effect that we're bringing and the positive Im impact that we're having on these young girls. And I wouldn't be able to do that if it wasn't for the team, Aston Martin, around the Formula One team. So. They're giving me the tools to be able to inspire the younger generation and I'm very proud to be a part of this movement. We race all over the world in Formula One. It's so important that we leave a positive impact and a positive mark in countries that we go to that perhaps wouldn't have that opportunity to see something like that if we weren't going there. So it's a really special moment for me and I'm very proud to have left such a positive impact. We are at the Riyadh Boulevard. It's quite spectacular. We are going to be shooting a cool video with a Ramco. Yeah, it looks pretty, pretty spectacular, to be honest, isn't it? Reminds me a bit of New York Times Square. It's nice to be back in the car as well. As you can see, we have completely taken over Riyadh Boulevard. We've got Jessica getting back in the car uh, shortly. She's going to be doing a demo run around this very venue um, in a couple of minutes' time. The team's building in partnership with Aramco and our other partners. It's building every day, every year. And um, it's credit to everyone involved, um, particularly our friends at Aramco, that we're now in a position to, to create you know, an amazing piece of content, which is going to look absolutely stunning. What we're trying to achieve with all of this is hopefully inspiring the next generation of uh, students and prospective engineers, racers, um, both here in the kingdom and, and more widely as well, more internationally, to engage with this content and to see this content and to ultimately pursue a career in a sport that we all love and we, you know, we really enjoy taking to, to fans around the world. So driving in the boulevard was incredible. When we first turned up, I said to them, are we really driving here? I thought there was so much glass and a screen everywhere. I thought the noise of the car was gonna shatter all of the, 
all of the glass and shops around us. But um, a very special moment. It's a very proud moment for me to be bringing such an influence into Saudi Arabia with Aramco's help. But I had a whale of a time and I think we left our mark in Riyadh.